naked and bathing with a garden hose just feet from a fire station. Tonight, that's the description of the man who firefighters say broke into their vehicles and stole their belongings. Tenders reporter Dan Haggerty is now live at the fire station in La Mesa. And, and Dan, they say this guy was planning to steal one of their vehicles as well, right? Well, here's the deal, guys. He, uh, the firefighters park their cars behind this fence while they're on their shifts. Well, they say this man hopped over this fence, started rooting through those cars, but before leaving the scene of the crime, decided to strip naked and take a shower. Take a look. This dripping spigot was the first clue. The second was the man standing at the other end of this hose in this patch of bushes behind the La Mesa fire station. And the man was naked. Battalion Chief Darren Drum told me the man said he was just using this hose to take a shower. Well, while police were being called, the crew in this truck returned from a call and came face to face with him. Pop up out of the bushes wearing um, La Mesa Fire Department clothing and then the guy disappeared. But this La Mesa fire gear didn't come from inside the station. It came from firefighters personal trucks. Clothes and this bag of tools were taken from this pickup and loaded into this camper truck that they think he was going to steal. I can't tell you exactly what he was doing, but that's what it appeared to us as though he was doing. And paranoid for a good reason, since another car was stolen from this gated lot just last month. The vehicle stolen, now we've had vehicles broken into. Um, it's sometimes a little frustrating. Police showed up and quickly found the naked hose bathing thief nearby, while firefighters here and to start locking their cars. This is a very small touch, um, a very small touch of the tragedy that we deal with all day, every day, with, that belongs to other people. And he's got a release from the La Mesa Police Department uh, identifying this guy as Lou Brent Edwards, 29 years old, from Benita. He's being charged with burglary and tonight is in jail. Reporting live from La Mesa, Dan Haggerty, 10 News.